walked by this one post and I was like, man, that would be perfect for Roger Castellano and I am a fresh soccer player. Um, to be honest, I would have to say my older brother. Um, you know, growing up, I always wanted to be the best, so I had to try to beat him. Uh, he definitely pushed me to that next level. Uh, and when I was able to accomplish that, I felt uh, I could further on and continue with that, uh, with that career I had in mind. Another one would just be family itself. Um, they've always been there, uh, supporting me in any way I, 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 I take. Um, as well, my, um, besides family, I would say uh, the friends, you know, always there to guide me or kind of, you know, push me um, in terms of, you know, just being there for me in general. Absolutely. Um, I definitely had a routine uh, before COVID happened and it uh, switched things up. I had to, uh, you know, change locations and things like that, but uh, I'm hoping for a, a better, uh, better year now. Let's see, what keeps me motivated? I would say just the continuous, uh, you know, time, you know, um, times of the essence. And so there comes moments where, you know, because of COVID happening, uh, now I want to get back out there again and, and, and prove I can, I can still do this and, uh, and um, make a good look for myself as well as continue to, to prove to myself I can do it, um, you know, after the, this negative impact we've all had. Um, hands down, it would be uh, playing for the USA Indoor National Team. Uh, I was able to um, get selected and have an opportunity to play with uh, with all the guys, and it was just a great experience as well as uh, being a part of uh, being able to represent my country. Um, my goals and where I see myself in 2021, probably just looking for that next team. Um, I'm going to keep training right now uh, because of COVID. A lot of you know things got shut down and. Uh, um, a lot of teams went hiatus, um, but once everything opens back up, I'd, I'd love to uh, show what I have and uh, represent the, the next team that's ready to uh, you know, take me. Five years from now, um, to be honest, uh, I want to play a couple more, um, but from there, I definitely see myself maybe uh, eventually get into a coaching role. You know, I've seen kind of the backbone of uh, how these operations work and you know, seeing what they need. And I'd love to put some insight and perspective uh, on the other side of the field to kind of, you know, now watching the game and hopefully maybe teaching the younger kids uh, things that they've missed that I wish someone had told me when I was at their age. Hello. <laughs> now we're going to move on to the segment called the set play. Okay. Here you're going to answer a couple of Spitfire questions within under a minute. Got it. Now we're going to see how it goes. All right. All right, let's do it. Favorite football position? Uh, defender. Favorite team? Real Madrid. Favorite player? Cristiano Ronaldo. Favorite boot? Cleat. Uh, I want to say Hypervenos, Nike. Pizza or burgers? Burger. Road trip or fly? Road trip. TikTok or Instagram? Instagram. Dad hat or snapback? Snapback. Scored by volley or header? Ooh, volley. Champions League or World Cup? World Cup. Weight training or cardio? Weight training. Jurgen Klopp or Jose Mourinho? Jose Mourinho. Ballon d'Or or World Cup trophy? World Cup trophy. Messi or Cristiano? Cristiano. Maradona hand of God or Maradona impossible goal? I'm going to say Maradona impossible goal. There we go. That's it. All right, Roger. Thank you for having us. Yes, thank you. We'll see you next time. All right, appreciate it. playing here last night? Yeah. yeah. Um, actually gonna be pushed over to the left oh, a little bit. Thing. Yeah. Okay. Oh no no 